I don't know. Are you sure you want to try this one? <laughs> it's Paxi Gaming with Mittens again. Hey, we're back. We're uh, back. <laughs> we're going to try something a little bit different. <laughs> this is The Consuming Shadow, the Insanity Edition by uh, Ben Yahtzee Crosaw, who is the, uh, the author of the Zero Punctuation series over on The Escapist, which I believe started up, good lord, like about 11, 12 years ago. Is there a normal edition we can play? Well, no, you have to go hard, so you have to be insane in order to play this game. Okay. The only way to win is to not play at all. <laughs> so we're going to see how much tolerance Mittens has for horrendous, awful things. This is a Lovecraftian, roguelike, uh, 2D, side scroll em up kind of adventure. Right. In which you are trying to halt an evil, ancient being from entering our world and presumably doing awful things to oh, it. Oh, good. So the background noise kind of sounds like a bunch of bees. Just really muffled the... Wow. Wow. Yep. <laughs> Bee noises. So, click a new game here. April 6, 2012. A shadow is trying to enter our world. Uh -oh. One of the ancients. The runes confirm it. I don't know which one. All I know is that they arrive at Stonehenge three days from now. One hope remains, the ritual of banishment. Four runes incanted at Stonehenge will close the gateway. The trouble is, I don't know what the ritual is. If I investigate this strange event heralding the shadow, maybe I could piece it together. That's all I have, a maybe. No, fuck this noise. Oh, jeez. Dead. Achievement get! Yay! Pixelated blood and static. <laughs> so, I mean, that guy didn't have a whole lot of stones and courage to, to face the consuming shadow. So, we're on to now person number two. <laughs> now it's January 12th in 2015, and his voice has to sound different, so... A shadow is trying to <laughs> enter our world. One of the ancients. The runes confirm it. I don't know which one. All I know is that they arrive at Stonehenge three days from now. It's, it's never one of the new ones. They're all preoccupied in their smartphones. They're like, nah, we don't need to invade the earth. We have smartphones. The ancient ones are like, oh, these youngins and their smartphones, we're going to go invade this, earth. This ancient Cthulian horror is kind of like, well, fuck, like the world's already taken over by smartphones and technology. I mean... We want the technology. That's why they're coming here. They want our smartphones. That's the only reason they're coming here. So we're here to stop the ancient from claiming our Apple smartphones, smartphones and our Androids and our... Yes, exactly. And um, our Wi-Fi. Other Linux-based devices. Yeah. That's all they want. They just want our <laughs> smart devices. Yes. Even with a maybe, we shall begin our journey. Yes. Uh oh We have 60 hours. <laughs> we have 60 hours to... Don't save look the back. world. So you can't use your review mirror. How are you gonna back up? We'll, we'll cross that bridge when we get to okay. it. Okay. Received a text from the Ministry of Occultism or Moo. M O O. <laughs> the Moo. From the Moo. Yay! <laughs> Find the information you need in Moo. towns tainted by the shadow. Moo. You might make some maybe a headway if you went Moo. to Blissall. Are you having fun there? Yes. Because <laughs> I'm worried. I'm glad to see you're taking this so seriously. Uh, I can't, because otherwise I'm just going to be scared. Okay, so we don't have a whole lot for the way of equipment. We have some bullets. We have a gun. We have a needle full of... Drugs. ...questionable substance, which allows I... me to regain sanity. Because I have sanity level, which is like... Like like an oil dipstick. In your ear. Because I can pull it out. And, yep, I'm sane, not sane. So. <laughs> and this is set in jolly old England. I love the, the coffee stain here. That's oh, good. that's cute. Yeah. So we do know that Bliss Hall is it's apparently there. a tainted town because it is red. Red suggests that it's overrun by by Nothing the good. evil shadow creatures. Yeah, it's also in the coffee stain, so yes. it's doubly screwed. It's doubly screwed because now it's in the coffee stain. <laughs> so I'm going to go to Lawton and drive. I find it curious, it's in Britain, but I thought that they all used the metric system, so I don't know why it's all in miles, but okay. Another message from the Moo. Shall I open it? Yes. Are you sure? Yes. What if something terrible happens? <laughs> that will be scary. What if a monster leaps out of my phone? What if they're already here? <laughs> I will open it. <laughs> the shadow has a definite foothold in Stonechester. That's an awkward name, Stonechester. Yeah, Stonechester. And it's going to make its move soon. Don't expect a warm welcome there if you let this slide. Okay. Stop. So it's a destination. 
yeah, so presumably in nine hours, the town will become um, tainted. It'll be consumed. Okay, so we want to deal with that first we then? We might want to. I'm going to keep driving to Lawton only because that's the way we were going, but... Uh, we'll have to keep an eye on it. Uh, Driving simulator. Yep. Lawton. So this seems to be an okay town, because everything seems more or less normal here. I'm going to enter the town. The town is calm and peaceful. That's not Oblivious good. Oblivious of the shadow. My heart feels pained and heavy as I'm confronted by what we stand to lose if I fail on my mission. I'm doing the wrong voice. That was the other guy. Yeah. The other peril dimension. Whatever. Uh, I have some cash. It's all in pounds, so it's in quid. We have 15. So that's about, what, 31 dollars? Uh, on this side of the pond would be, uh, I I'd guess two to one, so about 30 bucks, so. Um, find supplies. After an hour. After an hour, I have found the following items on sale for individuals content not to ask questions. Oh, lockpicking. Oh, fuck Sweet. yes. Absolutely, yeah, we're gonna get that. Now we can go into people's houses. Yep, now we can go into people's houses. Steal their China figner figurines, because, you know, that's what you do in post- or What's the opposite of post-apocalyptic? Pre-apocalyptic? Pre-apocalyptic. Yeah, world is you. Yeah, because we want to get figurines. those China figures before the ancients do. Exactly. Turn to car. I am broke. I have one pound to my name. <laughs> received a text from an unknown number. <gasps> oh, oh, no. <laughs> oh. Oh! Hey, that's awesome. Hi, I don't know you. A dream told me that I should help you out, so I sent you 12 quid. I hope that's enough. Okay! So I just, through my PayPal, I just got almost all the money back for yeah. my lockpicking purchase. You got about that's, 25 bucks, that's yeah. That's quite lucky. <laughs> Nice. All right, let's go. Let's go to Stoinchester. Uh, yeah, I can get there in six hours for sure. All right, let's, let's go. go. Broom. Do you have to gas up? or is this No, one gas of is not a, a thing you have to worry about. You electric to vehicles like that. that doesn't require gas. Perhaps it's a hybrid. <laughs> I stopped to enter a corner kind of shop that didn't look abandoned. It was confronted by an armed man in hastily assembled survival gear, demanding money from a terrified cashier. He attempts to simultaneously cover both me and the cashier with his gun, flicking his aim left and right. His eyes are wide and nervous. What do we do? Holy oh, shit, what do we do? Geez. Okay, so we... Uh, 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 <laughs> holy shit! I don't, uh, help! What yeah, do we do? I don't know, what do we do? What do I do? I don't know. Um, well, he's, he looks nervous. Can we try and talk to him? You want to talk to this man? He's uh, armed, he has a gun! Yeah. Okay, sure. With my hand in the air, I indicate behind myself with my shoulders at the door of the darkness outside. I point out that whatever world we now live in, the usefulness of money has been severely reduced. Hey, that was the good results. That was the right choice. <laughs> he gave me 40, 14 quid, yeah. underbinding my argument somewhat. Eh, uh, sure. Great. I'll take that. Awesome. That was the right choice. Stonechester. Now you see it's all dark. Oh, and geez. brooding and gritty. Do we have night vision goggles? I am brought to the problematic area problematic. and told that payment will be made once the problem is dealt with. I don't think the locals fully understand what sort of presence is in their town, but they showed much relief and gratitude, and I made my way inside. It's a dungeon! Escape to the controls. Okay, I need to remind myself how to do. So it's uh, WSAD. I can fire the gun with my, with my gun button. The bullets kind of look like fingers. Do they? Yeah. Oh, they do kind of look, yeah, they got little <laughs> fingertips. Yeah, I can see that. So there's six of them. Yeah. Don't worry, we'll use them. We'll just plug them into the gun and that'll be all right. I'm in sure this room. is fine. Yeah, find and destroy a nest. A nest of what? <laughs> so, I'm just gonna let the ambient noise. Well, it, this is effectively a... What was that arrow? Okay. Oh, what's this? The Eeyu room has been described in the wall <laughs> here. White. A generic prayer to a god. Not necessarily the bard perverting this place, it could be intended for an associated deity. Okay. Uh, how do I encamp runes again? Oh, right, tear. There we go. I can encamp that room sometimes. Seems a little more distinct for a moment. Okay. Cool. Oh, little thing I found here. Yeah, that little do 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 means you found something in here. Oh, you found Oscar. 
In a pile of useless metal implements, I found a small tool that functions as a lockpick. Well, kind of useless because we have a lockpick kit. Yeah. But well, I guess you can use your crap one first. Well, if I ever lose that kit, yeah, it might be yeah. helpful. Okay. Sometimes. Ah! It's a bug! Got him! Got that bug. So, you see, being hit by that, I've lost a little bit of sanity oh. and uh, a little bit of health. So, I'm going to unlock this door because I have my lockpick kit. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Piss off, you. Yeah. And you. Yeah, we did it. What did these New Age types do? What sort of forces they were toying with? I think that any anxiety they find is relieved by the Achum mantra would probably be cancelled out. I've learned a spell. Ooh. That's really neat. So actually, that's all I had to do. In um. fact, that's all I needed to do <laughs> was to find that nest and destroy it. Okay. Learn a spell. But there's more stuff. What's this? I found an ancient with two bullets. That's good. An ancient pistol with three bullets. Wow, I'm getting a lot of bullets here. That's that's good because I'm a I'm a bullet using kind of guy. I found Oscar. Someone found their key ring. I can open all the doors. Nope, I'm out of here. I can go into someone's house. How do I? The patient has become an irrationally terrified of the color white, <laughs> to the point that absolutely no progress can be made if I'm wearing any garment of that color. Oh, A change of medication may be in order. Yikes. Hmm. Irrationally terrified of the color white. That? Yeah, that's a clue. The color white. Okay, so here's the kicker with uh, trying to banish the ancient is that we know there's a ba there's an ancient coming in, but it's one of three. One of three ancient, incredible, great old ones, for yeah. lack of a better term. We just need to invite it to a wedding. Problem solved. What? It, it's a, terrified of the color white. If the bride's wearing a white wedding dress, the ancient will just go, ah! Okay, well, it's, it's not referring out. to the fear of the ancient, it's the fear of the mortal man who just can't comprehend the color white. It sees bride's face, and it's just, it's, it's bridezilla. Yeah. It's, it's bridezilla. They're just like, holy <laughs> hell, I don't want anything to do with that. Picks up the groom and throws him back down. So she makes, makes her way to the center of town. Bridezilla. Yes. <laughs> so, we know that there are three gods, and we know that one of them is associated with the color white. The aspect is... It would be pain, madness, lust, disease, fear. or fear. In this case, it would be fear. But we don't know what their agenda is. Um... The rune seems to be Eu because we saw. Uh, well, no, maybe not. Actually, that was fairly. That, that not, that's not quite clear. But there are five runes, five colors, five aspects, five names, and the agenda would either be they are the invader we want to banish. Yeah. Uh, they're not the invader. So they're fine. Or they are a possible invader. So oh, I'm going to say that well, they're a possible invader. So there is always a three. There's always a triumvirate, in that one of them is the invader, one of them is the friend of the invader. And one of them is an enemy of the invader. Ah. So, you know. The enemy of our enemy is our friend. Something <laughs> like situation. that. Yeah. As, as okay. best as can be told. Yay. So, yeah. <laughs> so, we must gather clues to identify the enemy and then travels to Stonehenge to banish them. That's Travel that. to Stonehenge to invite them to a wedding. That's the job. <laughs> So yeah, that's uh <laughs> How do you regain health? <laughs> the people waiting for me outside seem determined not to ask questions. Thirty bucks! Thirty thirty quid. Thirty so pounds. That's what, 60, it's like sixty bucks, yeah. Sixty dollars. Upon my assurance that the problem is resolved, they pay without quibble. That's a great word. Quibble. I wonder if this will be the last time I visit this town. I hope so. <laughs> Stones, Chester. Okay, so now this is a, a cleansed town, for the most part. For now. So I'm going to go Physical to the hospital. hospital. Get myself patched up. Walk in clinic, and I can buy drugs, or I can refill my med kit. Now, actually, uh, my med kit is full, so here's how I do this. So what I should do, uh, I'm going to go go back to my car. Mm -hmm. Go over the side here. I don't know why everything's red. That's actually That's not great. <laughs> I'm going to use the med kit to refill my health. Yep. Go back to the town, visit the hospital, and then and refill then the medkit. There we go. All that right. cost me no time. Sweet. So that went pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah. And I have a lot of money, so I'm going to see what else we have for supplies. Yeah. 
Um, Ooh, this is round armor next piercing. by driving, armor piercing rounds, and hollow points. Exhaust map player. So you can, what, sneak up on them? Uh, reduces to random events while driving. Well, you saw with the guy with the, the gun in his hands, yeah. that was a bit of a dicey situation. Yeah, yeah. So what we could do is we could reduce the likelihood of that happening. <laughs> and it's only seven, so yeah, okay, I'll get that. Why not? Rum. Yeah. Rum, indeed. Just double click. There we go. Okay. Uh, I've got some quick. bullets. I could stand to get a little bit more. Um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to say one, two, three... Do we even have a gun that we can use those in? If you've been paying attention, I have been using that gun to great effect so far. Though okay. I've also been smacking things. <laughs> you've been pistol whipping? I've been pistol whipping, yes. So Whoa. I think we're in fairly good shape for now. Oh, <laughs> received a text from a family member. Uh-oh. I'm sure that's fine. I'm sure that's fine. Are you uh, in are hiding? You hiding? <laughs> Strange people keep coming and asking about you. I haven't told them if I think you need money for food. I sent you seven. So more money. Fantastic. <laughs> Okay. Uh, I think we'll go Kidworth. to Chidworth. Uh, one thing I do know in, in listening to and reading some of Yahtzee's design, though, actually it was one of the people that helped beta test this, although I don't think I have any sort of credit on it, but uh, it was uh, the alpha or the beta test I remember helping with that, mm. um, is that he mentioned that all of the names, of course they're, they don't necessarily exist, but he takes a, a prefix and a suffix and it kind of randomizes. So you have uh, Waterborough, Twin <laughs> Church, Almsbury. Oh, I thought uh, that was Saltport, Amesbury. Saxton. Um, or uh, Row is a very common last pit of it. So Hers Row, or you might have Finn Row, or Sax Row, or whatever. We have Kids Worth, so let's go to Kid Worth. Kid Worth. Kid Worth. Rum. Rum. We go. Ooh. 51 hours left to go. Another text yeah. from the Moo. Yeah. What does the Moo want? The shadow has a definite foothold in Forley, and it's going to make its move soon. There's some extra cash in it for you, if you're willing. Always willing to make cash. Where is it? Where is it? Forley. Is it oh, I don't know if I'm going to make that. Six hours? We'll see, but I want to keep going to Kidworth. Six hours is quite a tight timeline. Okay, it looks dark here, okay. so that might tell me that the town is tainted. Maybe not. Nope, the Tom is okay. Okay. So, I failed my mission. Supplies. I don't really need supplies. I could, yeah, I could waste another hour. I guess, try it. Yeah. I oh, oh, lucky charm. But I, yeah, I don't have enough money. Increases loot. Yes, I think I'm going to get that. No, no. There okay, we there we go. That was weird. Because there's only 12 pieces of equipment in the entire game. I remember in the alpha or beta, whatever it was, there were lesser amounts so the equipment system was a little bit different yeah but, um, and then you uh, can choose what's active and what boons you something have. like yeah, that yeah, yeah okay. all right let's oh go. and those bullets are really really cheap um no i focus oh you can only carry six right right okay six fingers at a time six only six fingers at a time i can only handle six at a time all right let's try uh this all i know is a problem forly i'm not gonna make it in five hours no way so, even if you drive like a maniac? <laughs> even if I drive as a maniac, might. I'm going to go to Bliss Hall and let's clear these fuckers out. Shall we? Yes, we yes, shall. Yes, we shall. We shall. Shall. From a family member. Shall I open it? Yes. Yes. Hello, dear. You didn't think I forget your birthday, did you? It's I sent birthday. you nine pounds. Do you Hello. try to invest it? I am getting some crazy amounts of cash, I have to say. Yay. I'm actually quite surprised. It's just... I inhabit upon a small country church where a number of locals have taken shelter. From the indistinct words drifting out of the entrance doors, it sounds like some kind of sermon is taking place. Nope. I am finding the prospect of peaceable human contact extremely enticing. Nope. <laughs> should I go in and listen, or should I get back on the road? Uh, well, we have a certain amount of time, right? So I would... we got about 49 hours left to go. Yeah, maybe just let's go back and let's get going. Just ignore and keep going? Yeah. Okay. We're back on the road. We're gonna keep going. Keep going. It's most definitely tainted here because the, the fog oh, indicates fog. that something something that terrible bad has happened. happened here. There's a very the town. a monster that's been eating way too many beans. Reports have reached me of mysterious pests rising up from the ground at numerous places. Too large to be rats. Not to mention too aggressive 
and too organized. A situation like this is just the first sprouting seed of a total invasion by the shadow. I feel that it won't be long before these creatures go larger and bolder, or someone else gets some monstrous infection from a scratch. I must root out the nest before it reaches that point. And we're gonna do that next time. I'm so scared. <laughs> next time on Back to Gaming with, with the Visions. We shall investigate further. Thank you.